Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So this video has been requested for a while and it's what I do on a weekly basis with my hair and how I grew my hair so fast. So um, I know a lot of people have been asking like, how did you grow your hair so fast? How did you grow your hair so fast? And um, I was even wondering myself, like what have I been doing differently to make my hair grow so fast? And not just like my hair on my on my head but like my hair on my body has been growing like crazy and I'm just like yo that's not something that I want I'm the type of person like from my nose down to my feet I want to be hairless that's just how I am I like being smooth I think um, it's good for hygiene I just do not like hair on my body so yeah I've been having to shave like every single day because my hair has been growing so quickly. Um, of course, I don't mind my hair on my hair growing fast. I mean, of course, I don't mind the hair on my head growing fast, but you know, everywhere else, you know, that's a problem. But that's a different story for a different day, I guess. But um, it all dawned on me when I was watching one of Natural 80, Natural 85s recent videos and I will link it down in the description box if you didn't watch it and she was just saying how she basically wanted to grow her hair out and all this stuff so she said that something like people with straighter straighter texture hairs um they wash their hair more frequently and they have less tangles because they are always washing their hair and I was just like wow that makes a lot of sense and I was just like, well, you know what? I do that because what I've been definitely doing different these past couple of months, and I haven't really even noticed it, was was I take a shower and wet my hair every single day. Like I co-wash every single day. So basically, when I so basically when I get in the shower, I usually shower at nighttime. Sometimes I shower in the morning, but like I usually shower at nighttime. So I have. So what I do is I hop into the shower, I immediately drench my hair and conditioner, and then you know I, you know I shave because obviously I gotta shave every day for some reason. Um, you know, wash my body, all the you know stuff that we do in the shower, and so about 10 minutes or 15 minutes later, I you know comb out my hair it's like second nature to me it goes so quickly I don't even notice like I, my hair is hardly never ever tangled because I've been doing this every single day and I think that that is what made a difference in my hair definitely because I know, I know it's, it may sound like high maintenance, like you're doing this every single day, you're washing your hair every single day, um, but it's a co-wash in my hair because I don't use shampoo. I mostly just co-wash my hair every single day. So for me, it's just like second nature now. Like I do it every day and my hair dries in, a, my hair dries in about, um, 40 minutes to an hour and then I go to sleep. It's, it's just super, super easy. easy. And I know a lot of you out there might be looking at me crazy like there is no way I'm about to wet my hair every day. But it makes way more sense to do that instead of wait a week or whatever where your hair is like tangled and stuff because you haven't touched it all week. So um that's been like a huge life changer for me i've been doing it every day for like the past five months and i've definitely seen my hair continue to grow and and look a lot healthier than it was another thing that i have been doing is i've been taking vitamins and you guys like I'm not a vitamin taker. I do not like vitamins. I haven't taken any hair. I haven't taken any hair vitamins since like last year when I first started my YouTube channel. If you're like OG, you've been around here for since before my YouTube channel got hacked and stuff. You would know that um, I was on Hair Affinity, and I took Hair Affinity for about three months. They get they 
they gave me a three month supply so I took it for three months and I did see progress but it wasn't like a tremendous amount of progress so I was just like I'm not taking no more hair vitamins <laughs> because one it's not something that I like was looking forward to doing like oh I get to take my vitamins right now um I was like dreading taking my vitamins like a child or something like I don't want to take my vitamins but um, ever since I found these vitamins, oh my gosh, you guys, like I am excited to take my vitamins. Taking my vitamins is the highlight of my day, okay? Um, no lie, no lie. So these are the vitamins that I've been taking. They're all gone, they're by GNC. They're called Be Beautiful and they are chewy vitamins. And I heard about these vitamins from um, Kelsey Janae, she did a video talking about these vitamins. And I didn't buy them for my hair or anything. I actually bought them for my health because I was having really bad gout problems in my hand and like my hand was aching really, really bad. And my mom was telling me like, you need to take your vitamins. You don't take vitamins, that's why your hand is aching. So um, I just was like, that's a sign. I should go buy these vitamins, they're chewable. They, probably are a lot more pleasurable than regular vitamins so that's what I did I went out um I didn't go out I went I went to Amazon <laughs> I went to Amazon and I bought these and they were around 22 bucks and the best 22 bucks I ever spent because not only is this really helping my gout problem but it's helping my hair skin and nails as well so yeah, it does have biotin in here, and I was kind of worried that it would make me break out because I do have like sensitive skin that are, that is kind of prone to breaking out if I take too much biotin because um, a couple of years ago, I was trying to grow out my hair, so I was just taking like the regular biotin, and it broke me out like crazy, so I was just like, you know what, I'm not taking biotin anymore, but I have not experienced any type of breakouts from this. And I love taking them. I be popping these like candy. You don't supposed to do that. I had to like slow down. I'm like, let me only take the recommended amounts, which is two a day. And I just love it. I'm all gone. I'm going to have to go buy some more. But I've just been loving these vitamins. Hair oils that I've been trying out that um, actually is marketed towards hair growth. So... This one is called Cara Veda, and it is basically supposed to help people who are um, dealing with baldness or shedding or breakage. And um, I'm, not that I'm dealing with any of those problems, but it still has a lot of good ingredients in these type of products that promotes hair growth. So I've been definitely. Um, trying out this and I mix this with another hair oil that I've been trying and it's called Shamaya oil. Um, the owner of the company is actually really really nice so I wanted to try this out and yeah it smells amazing and it's just another type of hair growth that's supposed to help with dry hair and promote hair growth as well. The tip that has really really helped me is by mixing oil with the conditioner that I use. So I will put a little bit of one of these oils or castor oil because we all know that castor oil is great at promoting hair growth. I will put that into my conditioner and just um, really massage that into my hair or my ends and it really, really makes a difference. Um, the oil with the conditioner. This is These are the conditioners that I have been using and loving. Um, it's by Jesse Curl, and she sent me over the Citrix Lavender line, which is great for dry hair, and I have been loving this line like crazy. I actually left the um, cleansing uh, conditioner in the shower, so I don't feel like going to get it, but I will try to insert a clip or something. But the packaging basically all looks the same. This is just a regular, a regular daily conditioner, and this one is a deep conditioner, and I've been loving them. Um, smells really good, like I was saying before, I mix this with some type of oil and just go about my day in the shower. And a 
another point that I wanted to make was I don't deep condition my hair weekly hair um, weekly anymore because I don't feel the need to do that since I do condition my hair every single day in the shower um, I might put like a deep conditioner like once a week into my routine but, but it's never like a long process at all I keep it down to however long I'm in the shower so if I start off in the shower instead of using just a regular conditioner I will use a deep conditioner that day um, but it's not like a long tedious I'm gonna sit under the dryer and I'm gonna keep this conditioner in my, in my hair for an hour because I to me honestly I don't I don't feel a difference between having deep conditioner in my hair for 10 minutes and having deep conditioner in my hair for two hours. There is no difference to me. So, um, yeah, I would just like deep conditioner in the shower. And I don't do it weekly. I just do it whenever I feel the need to do it. Um, yeah. So, I do still use my hair massager. A couple of you have been asking me about that. And I'll link that video down below so you can see exactly how I use it and all that jazz. That was like, that was a good deal. It was only twenty dollars. Twenty dollars. I bought it off eBay. It was freaking amazing. It feels good. I still use it regularly, and it's it's definitely been been promoting hair growth. And yeah, that's about it. That's about all that I have been doing to really try to grow out my hair. Um, I think I'm making great progress. My hair is. I'm looking very thick, very healthy, and I'm so proud of my hair because it's definitely come a long way from when it was damaged and thin and brittle and just not the way I would have liked it. So, um, yeah, I want to thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you liked it or if it was helpful for you, please give me a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if you're not already subscribed. I love you guys, and I'll see you guys in my next video.